We're all Sorry, I'm a little nervous for coming on here because I know there's like thousands of people watching. <laughs> well, I come from a very nihilistic atheist family. So, you, yeah. so now, after watching all those videos and reading the Quran, do you believe there's one Allah? Mm hmm. Is Nicole there? There Nicole's she is. There. Hello. Hey, how, how are you? you? I'm good. How are you? Sorry, I'm a little nervous for coming on here because I know there's like thousands of people watching. <laughs> Just relax. It's it's all everything's between you and your creator. That's the only one that sees everything that matters. The rest, everybody, mm -hmm. whatever. Yeah. So well, honestly, I'm really glad I came on here tonight because you guys have some really good arguments. Um, and I've had some doubts, but I have like firm. I have I have firm belief, honestly. So. <laughs> Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. That's beautiful. It's always beautiful to hear that. Uh, you know, it mm -hmm. amazes me how many people come on, uh, whether it's at the park or whether it's on, on Strive, on a live streams like this, that aren't really looking for the truth. And we may go through all these arguments and give all these clear evidences, but it doesn't affect them because they're not looking for it. And there's people like you that are looking, that are open-minded, their hearts are open, and Allah guides them. That's beautiful. Yeah, and it's um, where are you? Where, where are you in the U.S. or in the U.K.? Where? Yeah, I'm in the U.S. Okay. Uh, yeah, I actually started watching is... your um video at work earlier, <laughs> nice. all the way to home. So I've been on wow. since the beginning. Um, we're gonna nice. say like a little of my background or story or something. Well, Please. I come from a very nihilistic atheist family. Um, and I've kind of been on a, my own journey of like seeking the truth, I guess. And I've always asked for God's guidance in my own way. Um, and then one night I got this random like thought, like, what is this llama about? And I got into a whole rabbit hole on YouTube. It connected me to somebody in Sudan, uh, pen pal. And then I went and bought a Quran and I started reading and I had questions like a lot of these other people on here had and Brendan before me, um, which I watched some of your videos. Um, <laughs> a lot of your videos actually. Um, and then I'm here now. So I've kind Allah of. Akbar. So, so, you, yeah. so now after watching all those videos and reading the Quran, do you believe there's one Allah? Mm -hmm. Do you believe the Prophet Muhammad is his last messenger? Yes. Excellent. You are a Muslim. We will do your shahada as well. And okay. again, like I said, that's just the beginning. Uh, after that, mm -hmm. uh, like you, One Message Foundation or Majd Ribat or Brother Mansoor's Dawah Wise or Hamza's stream or Asadullah Ali's stream or all the other brothers that have content, you can go watch and learn. Um, let us know what city you're in. We can try to connect you with some of the good Muslims that are on the right aqidah and things in your city uh, to help you, inshallah, to grow and learn, support. All of us are going to be your brothers and sisters uh, you might meet some Muslims that aren't the greatest Muslims. Not all of us are perfect, but uh, this Ummah will be your uh, will be a part of the family that you will be a part of. So, yeah, I'm um, speaking on that really quickly. I've actually tried to contact some masjids here. And what city really are you got... in, if you don't mind sharing? I'm in Norfolk, Virginia. Okay, uh, no problem. Send me your uh, through Hamza. Send me your contact information. Okay. And uh, we'll get you, we'll get some uh, the local masajid and people to come and contact you. Virtually, a lot of Muslims, alhamdulillah. We know some good Muslims okay. out there, mashallah, on the right aqidah and right way, so that th there'll, be a, there'll be a family for you. And uh, Hamza, if you can send me her contact as well, uh, you, you can even have, we have the OMF sisters that can contact you and keep in touch to help you learn the prayers and answer any questions, inshallah. Okay. All right. So, Arabic first or English first? We'll do my catch line now. All right. <laughs> I always like it when people say Arabic because then that shows that they're ready for some. Uh, all right. Ashhadu. Ashhadu. Al. Al. La. La. Ilaha. Ilaha. Illallah. Illallah. Wa ashhadu. Wa ashhadu. Anna. Anna. Muhammada. Muhammad Abduhu Abduhu Wa Rasulu Wa Rasulu Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar <laughs> Where are you guys at man? Come on Mansoor Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar.
This is, you know, Actually. some people, uh, they wonder why, but this is from the Sunnah to say Allahu Akbar, not to say takbir and people say it together, but when the Sahaba, when somebody becomes Muslim, they would say Allahu Akbar. All right. <laughs> I bear witness. I bear witness. There is none worthy of worship. There is none worthy of worship. Except Allah. Except Allah. And I bear witness. And I bear witness. That Muhammad. That Muhammad. Is the servant. Is the servant. And messenger of Allah. And the messenger of Allah. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. Allah. The greatest day of your life. I this know. day, your whole past is cleaned. All those sins, mistakes, whatever are gone. You're like a newborn baby. Mistakes of the past are turned into <laughs> good deeds. You are Muslim. Allahu Akbar. This is the, the purpose of your creation. Today, you have found it. And now yes, uh, you have to learn how to make the wudu, how to pray, you got fasting. But but now you're a new person. You have connected to your creator. I mean, what is greater than that? No <laughs> amount of money, no amount of uh, power, or any of that can be worth accepting the truth. So yes. I'm really happy. Uh, and inshallah, Hamza, if you can uh, get the contact information well, and we'll, can I, we'll connect them. Is it okay if it. I say something? <laughs> okay, uh, Sister Nicole, congratulations. Inshallah, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala facilitate you. That said, I just want to give some advice as a fellow revert of 13 years. You're going to experience a lot of things that you don't understand. You're going to see a lot of things that may confuse you. It's going to be a culture shock as well. Sheikh uh, Uthman kind of hinted at it. I'm just going to tell you one thing. You're going to be zealous, and that's a good thing, but take things slow. Be gradual in the understanding of things. Learn things one at a time. Don't try to consume everything at once. Just take it slow. The companions of the Prophet ﷺ were gradually introduced to Islam. You need to be as well. Mm -hmm. Just take your time. Okay? Thank you so much. No problem. Jazakallah. Mm -hmm. And same uh, advice I gave Brandon. Reach out to me on uh, Facebook, on Hamza's Dad. And then I can okay. connect you to the right places, inshallah. Thank you so much, everybody. <laughs> Thanks for coming on, Nicole.